right. So this will be another another Mike makes a flyer, part of the continuing series. Mike makes a flyer. Um, this time we're going to. Hmm, if if you're going to be farming, my suggestion is is that when you identify the farm, uh, create a saved search. So we're going to do these. We're going to do that. Are there any con do you knock on condominiums in that area? No. Okay. Who wants to no, list? No, there is. There is townhomes. All right, but we're not worrying about that. Zero minus thirty. Change date and. The zip code was 95014. 95014. We're going to do a map search so that we can identify. Then we'll save it once we get someplace where we want to be. And I believe Stokes, S T O K E S, was a, that's the wrong one. Stokes, 95014. I know I've. Uh, when you get old, it's hard to remember anything, right? That's why my father used to say, don't ever get old. I'm not sure what he had in mind, but so if we were to get down the foothills and over, is that area enough? So uh, the, I'm going to do the box tool. Is that one? One million, do you want to include that one? On Meadow? All right, you're not convincing me. So how about that far down? Terrace? Mm, okay. All right. Not sure it's not terrace, yeah. Okay, so we're just gonna do that. And then if we click on results, we'll see we got 17. Now one thing we might wanna do is save this and we're gonna say it's a new safe search and this will be um, C-U-P-E-R-T-I-N-O farm. Oh, is that right? Mm -hmm. Okay. And so we're saving it. Now we click on that and we're going to, <laughs> once we've clicked on that and we go to actions, we can go to export and we pick the market update export and then we export it. And we leave it there, and we open it up, and then highlight the first row, hit the corner, just to format, because I like everything the way it's supposed to be, and then highlight the first column, go to data, sort, A to Z, A to Z, so the actives are all first. And then what I usually would do is say, we don't need total, we just want beds, baths, square feet, uh, list price, sales price, that's all good. Then we click on this, we go back to home and to format and auto fit, nice and you know. And then the square feet, I like the comma as a separator and for the prices I want a dollar sign, but I don't want all those decimal points. And then now that we've done that, we go back to format, auto fit column width, everything lines up nice and neat. And then we copy that. And um, if there, notice it says formatting, uh, color scale, I don't know what those things are. That's, uh, uh, I don't know. So um, formatting it in Excel causes issues. So let me do this, uh, W-O-R-D, and then nicest looking tables exist, oops. <coughs> Control C. Oh. Control-C, Control-V, click on this, select table, and then it doesn't, um, if you highlight the whole thing and then double click in the middle, it formats everything into a nice, nice little box. We click on design and we 
click on this here. That, is there a color you like? This isn't a lot of choices. Oh, but there aren't more choices. You like green, red, black. Is this going to be black and white or color? Green. Color. Red. Red. So it's not really red. It's sort of that orangey thing. Is that okay? Yeah. Or do you like yellow, blue, green? And, uh, whoops, what did I do? How about that one? All right, so, eh. yeah, okay. So now that we've done that, you click there, control C to copy it. We go back to our PowerPoint and then what we're, I should have done this first. We're going to um, just move all of this stuff uh, away, put that away. We're going to keep our call to action down there. Oh, and I also have noticed that it likes to change, change what it looks like now. And so uh, we would call this, is there a, the area, does it have a name? No. no. So um, we're just going to say, look at what your B-O-R what am I I'm B-O-U -E <laughs> anyhow so um, the nice thing about most Microsoft products is that they have spell check and they, they're not sure about your name, so we're going to add it, and we're going to add that, and we're going to add that, and we're going to add that, and we're going to probably add that, and I don't know, I don't really want to add all these. So, uh, but anyhow, apparently we spelled neighbors right. Do you like cute little graphics, little pictures yeah. of people that are, um, and so uh, if we were to, and some people find these these sort of creepy, but you know, do you know what the difference is between icky and creepy? This is something to so um, what? <laughs> I knew you'd like that. Oh yeah, look at your n e i g h b o r s. Look at your neighbors. I'm typing that in, and I'm going to click on images. And uh, see if there's anything. All right, so I would just look at, look at neighbors. No, that's not really what I had in mind. Um, looking so we find a how about that does that guy is that creepy or icky which of these do you think is creepy or icky do you see any of these that you like how about that oh that one I like that one uh, that one looking for a good agent Looking for friends, just looking, 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 looking. We could just skip. We could maybe skip this. I, you know, I don't know. Really? She's got a cute face. How about this one? If you one? had something like looking, look what your neighbors are up to, is that what you wrote? Yeah. And then the one down, 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 down. Down and left. Down. That one? Down, down, down. There. See, she's looking up. This one here? Yeah. And she's not creepy or icky. Uh, so how about the babies looking up? Kind of creepy. Kind of creepy. Totally wrong. Do you like that? <laughs> or how about this? That's sort of stock. No. Huh? So we don't actually have to have a picture, but we could uh, look at what your neighbors are up to. That guy looks a little like a little bit stalking. See, I actually would probably have done. Something like that, all right? Because they're just sort of whatever, right? But we don't, 
We don't actually need to have a picture, but we could put in a picture. Sometimes, you don't like that? Here's the picture of a home. All right, well, um, how about this? Um, we're going to type in real estate market update, and how about which of these? Do you like that one? Do you like that one? Why don't I just pick something, and then we'll... How about this? Yeah. All right, so we found this picture, not icky or creepy, same image as, and we're just going to save it someplace. Um, pictures, save, back. Okay, back here. So, um, and you know, there's room for you to put in a little bit more stuff. So we're going to insert the picture. Haven't you missed us, my girlfriend? It's the only reason I'm here. That's it. All right. So, what do you think of that? Yeah. Uh, I mean, that's sort of a gratuitous graphic. We make this a little bit bigger, and there's that call to action. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So the. Since we have a little bit of room, we're going to scooch that up a little bit in size. Move this over. Move this over. When I, so I might just make it a second line and then stick it in the middle like that. All right. Are you happy? Okay, so now that we've done this, we're going to save it. You could print from this or make it a PDF. Who are you going to, how are you going to print it? I'm thinking Michael Lewis. Michael Lewis, that's something entirely different. Okay, so let's, let's see what, is, what would this mean in the Michael Lewis universe. So what I have to do is find Michael Lewis. That's not it, not it, not it, not it. Not it, not it, not it. So it's not Michael Lewis. How else can I print it on a thicker paper? Like? Well, you can print it y yourself on our, you could go buy the paper and print it on our copy machines. You could take it to Office Depot, Office Max, and let them print it. Um, and Michael Lewis disappeared from our, our list. So let's just do that. Okay. Now, Michael Lewis. Oh, what is it? It's ML, MLMS2 Ordering Store. I thought I'd logged in. Did I log in using the other? No. And you're still logged in. All right, so let's say you wanted to do this in Michael Lewis. So we're going to do a flyer, and we're going to do a market update, and then we're going to click on this. This is the hard part. We're going to edit the selected template. We're going to say, yeah, we're doing it without a back. Now, unless you have Michael Lewis printed, it's all going to be, you know, the same. They have good printing prices. So. I mean, that's the only ease about using it, that you can just order it and then come here directly. Right. Well, I know, but the problem is it takes a little while to make something. So this is what Michael Lewis looks like. So here's the statuses. If we double click, this is going to open up. Now what that would mean is if we go here and we grab that link, that group, that column and copy it. Then we go over here and we paste it in and 
we hit commit changes and now they're all there. But you see, the second thing is the date, right? Now we didn't put in a date because now if you really wanted and doing beds and baths together, mm, huh. so what we can do if we click on it, we can sort of move it over here and this we can sort of move over here and then we can move that there. And then we can move this here. <coughs> Let's see if we've run out of room at the bottom. Well, I don't know, maybe. And we're not going to call it a date, but we're going to. That's what she said. We're not going to call it a date. That has nothing to do with me. So we're now going to go over here and we're going to grab this list and copy it. And we're going to go back and we're going to click on this and we're going to put that in and commit changes. Right? Now, date, <sighs> uh, we're going to move it over a teensy bit. So what else do we have on our list? We have beds, baths, and square feet. So why don't we call one beds? And if we double click B E D S and commit, and then this over here, which was the date, we're going to move it over and then and then we're going to go over here and we're going to say beds. We want that, control C, right here. Uh, and then beds. OK. Then this bath thing, sometimes it's just easier to leave it where it is. You know, you know the part of the thing is you have to manually move things around. And I'm not sure they're all completely lined up. And this doesn't look nearly, um, we need to make this B-E-D-S. All right, see, it doesn't, you know, it doesn't line up. You see, I just don't like it that it's not perfect. This I can do. I mean, it's, it's fine thinking. I, if I have to just copy paste, then I'll do that. But what we're going to do is, You don't want me to finish it. I've gone this far. Oh, now you want she come. All right. So, so, all right. And this doesn't look like the same size as the others, does it? So we're going to maybe, I don't know. All right. So I like beds and baths next to each other. Right now, it might be easier to just change this to B A T H S and change this to All right. And then the price, we're sort of stuck with that. All right, so then we would go to Baz. Double click, control A, get rid of the last empty space, square feet. I don't want to stop now, I'm having too much fun. Copy that. Double click, control A. I don't know what the command is. Ooh, if it's a Mac, control V, hit one back, commit. Price. Now this is again, we go here. Now notice some of the prices is the list price and some prices are the sales price. So if we copy this and we paste it here and people just have to guess which one we're talking about based upon the status. So what we do is we, and then we commit changes. And wow, the reason why is this so big? Probably because it needs more space. All right, and 
So what? I don't know if there's a maybe. I think I think that once you've done this, you can save it, so we don't have to do it every time. Mm -hmm. So we move this over. We move that over. We need more room for the price mm -hmm. because our prices are so big that we need more room for them, and we're going to make that bigger. And isn't that now the only other thing you need to do is to go down here and read this. So this says 2013 was a great year for home values. So how about we say um, 2015 has been a great year for what? If you're thinking of selling, We don't do loans, so now may be the right time. We are available anytime conveniently at the Douglas and Roseville Parkway. So what I don't like that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the words that I wrote, and I'm going to go over here, and I'm going to um, copy it and go back here, and I'm going to... Uh, how about that? And then commit changes. And then uh, I would make this bigger. All right. You could write. We can add one more column, right? The list and sale. Yeah. We could. Yeah, but I'm list and sale are both. You see, it says active with the prices, pending with the price. I mean, it, it's you, we don't have to okay. but you could okay. adding a column is a bit of a pain mm. I'm just saying it's possible it's easier to delete but mm. and uh, that uh, I like your picture mm -hmm. well, I don't know everybody I, that's my picture too by the way when I so what we're going to do is save our work and you now have two flyers is that right? Yes. And I'm only charging you for one. Oh. I can do you. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to send you a copy of the one I did. And uh, I have to cut. Don't you like mine? Isn't mine nice? Yeah. Okay. So, doesn't like blue. Gosh. Okay. And. Uh, 